Alright guys, so back here with a supplement review of this product here. It's Genetics Nutrition's Revive, which is their um, BCA uh, product. Now Genetics Nutrition, uh, you, pff, you might not have heard of them, they're not exactly the most notable brand. They're an Australian brand, so I'm not sure if they're on the international market as such. But anyway, I really wanted to make a comparison between this product's amino acid profile and um, some of the other more popular um, BCA intra workout supplements on the market those being um, USP Labs Modern BCAs and also um, Skyvation's Extend. Now I've, tr I've tried um, both of those two and before I tried this I have to admit they were they were quite they were extremely effective I enjoyed them a lot they they tasted good they worked um, much better workouts when I was sipping on those than without. Whether there's a placebo effect there, undoubtedly there probably is. But anyway, but anyhow. Um, anyway, so this product here, um, its amino acid profile is really where it uh, sets it apart, I guess. And I think it's mostly due to the fact that it doesn't it doesn't include electrolytes in its in its uh, blend. Um, now, don't get me wrong, electrolytes, they're important. You know, sodium and potassium, they're the, the ions that the um, myocardium need to actually contract. They're essential. But at the same time, you don't buy this product. You don't buy a BCA product that's advertised, you know, mostly for its amino acids. You don't buy that for its electrolytes. Well, at least I don't anyway. And I'm pretty sure the majority of people don't. Because when it comes down to it, I mean, so sodium and potassium, they're dirt cheap. You can just... I mean, you can buy a Gatorade if you want, or you could just pour that in yourself, whatever you want. But, you know, most of us probably get a substantial amount of sodium and potassium from your normal diet anyway. So, in the end, it's really, it's really not that, it's really not that integral, and you're, you're wasting a lot of money, pretty much, because those two products, you know, Extend and um, Modern BCAs, a large portion of their um, serving size comes down to electrolytes. I mean, I'll put the uh, respective ingredient profiles up on your screens here. But as you can see, I mean, per serving size, um, this product here has substantially um, more amino acids. And it has the amino acids that you actually, you actually want. You know, L-leucine, L-isoline, L-valine. They're, the, um, they're the three most important amino acids when it comes to um, muscle regeneration. So... I mean, there could be an argument to say that uh, Extend and uh, USP Labs, you know, maybe they give you better, <laughs> maybe they, <laughs> maybe they give you better endurance in the gym, you know, from the electrolytes. But I haven't felt that at all. If anything, I found this has been more effective. So anecdotally, I would say this product is superior. And if you want the actual amino acids, then again, this product is superior. Now, in terms of other things like taste. This is the grape flavor. I've tried the watermelon as well. Both amazing. This one, this one comes out on top. It's kind of like a lolly kind of flavor. Very good, very good. Beats doesn't have any of that salty aftertaste that Extend has. So, like if I was to give Extend a seven, six or a seven, I'd give this. This has to be a ten. I mean, it's better than some you know soda drinks you get, to be honest. Um, so it's good there. It's good mixability. Value for money. It comes out on top. Especially when you consider, you know, what it is gram for, gram for gram in terms of its ingredient profile. Um, and that's pretty much it, guys. So I would actually recommend you do do try it out if you um, are into the, you know, intra-workout kind of supplement. I mean, there's a fair debate as to whether intra-workouts are really that important anyway, value for money-wise. However, I, f I don't take them when I'm in a cal caloric surplus. However, when I'm cutting... Uh, I do find them, you know, they do help you with your focus and um, maintaining your strength throughout your workout. Anyway, that's at least my opinion, whether that's placebo or not, who knows. I guess that's it, guys. Thanks for watching. I'll see you in the next video.